Hello, come on up. How are you doing? How are you? Gave it up back. Gave it up back. Got me up track. My name is Hannah Simone. I'm from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I got my start in music pretty much from my family. Growing up, my mom listened to a lot of hip hop, soul, R&B, and stuff like that. So a lot of my time was spent trying to like imitate that. Once my mom heard me sing and thought that I was okay at it, she kind of just threw me into lessons. Something is different, something is in the air. I had um, an instructor in high school that really pushed me, especially to like pushed me to get out on stage. I had a really hard time like being on stage and doing stuff like that, but he really pushed me. And then pretty much as I got older, I spent a lot of time listening to like Brandy Carlisle and Jewel and songwriters more so. Um, those are songwriters that are also great vocalists, so that helped me be able to like hone in on being a singer and a songwriter at the same time. I moved to Nashville, and I did two years at a music school in Nashville, um, and then I moved back home and I did a year at Concordia and um, a year at UWM. I love the Milwaukee music scene. It has been really like interesting, especially coming back from COVID, how to navigate um, the music scene as a whole but I have like the best band. They're like my greatest friends and they're kind of teaching me how to wiggle my way into the scene, which is full of just incredible like musicians, vocalists, um, producers. Milwaukee's full of great potential. Please give me space to think all these things through. All of my songs are written from like a place of vulnerability or um, an experience that I've been through. So I would hope that anybody that was listening to my song could take that song, whatever it is, and take from that at whatever capacity they need. Because there's never like a specific goal to a song of mine that I want somebody to hear specifically. I just want it to be so vulnerable and so like um, honest that people can listen to it and grab what they need to like hear in that moment. Some things are better left unsaid. Personally, like as an individual artist, um, I kind of wanted to be like an indie, kind of like a folk singer-songwriter, which is not the route we took, and I'm actually really enjoying like learning blues and rock and soul. Music is not like, um, it's not a hobby, it's not something that I just kind of like pick up and put down whenever I want to. Music was pretty much like my catharsis, like it was my consistent, it was always there. So. I do it because I literally have to, otherwise I, I just don't feel like myself. You gave it up back. You gave it up back. You got me off track. You gave all my loving up.